Hi guys, my name's Colsey and we're back in her story. I played a little bit before, I played quite a bit before actually, but I uh, I wanted to finish it. Or try and finish it anyway, I don't know. I don't know how close I am. Now I don't understand what this is, I never figured out what it is and stupidly I never looked into what it was, so uh, we'll just carry on looking. Now last time we found out that she was a twin, I believe. So that's why the videos were kind of weird, the ones that we were watching. They were kind of, uh, like she was, it looked like she was there twice, but I think that was one was her twin and one was her and they just looked very similar. I might be wrong. I haven't bothered doing any of the user tags either, which is terrible. Yeah. Well, they have one for the glaciers, but it's only for work. Okay, that's just asking about his. I can't remember his name. Kitchen. I saw it plugged into its charging cradle. Cradle. I can't remember his name. Simon, I think it was. Was it Simon? Yeah, it was Simon, right? So uh, they were talking about his phone because he's a glacier, which means he does glass or something. He works with glass. Oh, uh, I don't know. It's just a kitchen. Okay, that was apparently helpful. Uh, she looks weird there. So when was when's this one? Twenty fifth of the sixth, and this one's the eighteenth, and this one's twenty seventh. Okay, fair enough. She could have just put her hair up for that one, I suppose. Bruce. Oh yeah, no, it's nothing. I was going through the top cupboard in my kitchen, and the chair slipped, and I kind of hit the door with my face. We <laughs> hurt <had> like hell. <laughs> I mean, I don't believe her, but there we go. So when's this? 30th, and that is the 1st. So that's like, I don't know. I don't know my months. I don't know. That's either a day after or two days after, anyway. Okay. <clears throat> I parked up in the street. It was busy, so I had to park down the end of the road. Walked up, knocked on the door, no answer. I took my keys out of my bag and unlocked the door. The main lock was unlocked. You can tell because the key doesn't turn when you try to turn it to the left. I walked in, Simon's coat wasn't on the peg. I couldn't see his shoes in the shoe rack. I shouted out. Um, I walked straight into the kitchen because he usually sits in there to have a cup of tea and read his paper, but he wasn't there. I touched the kettle, it was cold. I looked quickly in the living room, nothing. I walked upstairs to the bedroom, he wasn't there. I didn't search for him because it was pretty clear he wasn't there. I had a shower. The phone rang whilst I was in the shower. I didn't answer it. I think it was Eric. Then I was just exhausted. So I lay down on the bed and I fell asleep. Though I didn't mean to. I woke up a couple of hours later and I was surprised to see no one in the bed next to me. And then I remembered where I was and what had happened. That's when Eric called again. This time I spoke to him. Then I called Doug and Eleanor. And I decided to come and see you. Don't know. Doug and Eleanor, who the hell are they? How long was that one? Oh my god, okay, we'll watch this one. See, she looks completely different. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I parked up on the street. It was busy, so I parked down at the end of the road. I walked up to the house, I knocked on the door. No answer. I took my keys out of my bag, unlocked the door. The main lock was unlocked. I could tell because the key wouldn't turn when I tried to turn it to the left. I walked in. Simon's coat wasn't on the peg. I couldn't see his shoes on the shoe rack. Um, I shouted out for him. I walked straight into the kitchen. He usually sits in there to have a cup of tea and read his paper. He wasn't there. I touched the kettle. It was cold. Um, I looked quickly into the living room. Nothing. I walked upstairs to the bedroom, he wasn't there. I didn't search for him because it was pretty clear he wasn't there. And then I... Got enough? That is an immediate, that is a quote. They're the same, uh, like, statement. They're both the same. So that's why I don't believe that is the same person. My sister is gone. Your sister? See? And she's never coming back. Oh. Could the hairs have come from somewhere else? Hairs? I mean, could they 
we have a lot of dolls in the attic. There's a Rapunzel doll with long blonde hair. Could they have come from there? Okay, well that's weird. That is a bit weird. Yes. I'm not sure where the dollhouse came from. Dollhouse? I don't know if it was given to them or they inherited it. I mean, they wouldn't have had the money to buy it. It was so huge. <laughs> it must have been taken up to the attic in parts and then reassembled up there. It is a beautiful thing. Wallpaper to scale. Little furniture. Back from the mall. Passports, diaries, we gave them all really a lap. We'd left the light on. We tried to kill it, but it was tough. What? We'd left the light on. It was making the most. So they're just killing the moths? We yeah. tried to kill it, but it was tough. We ended up crushing it under a copy of the Arabian Nights. You're weird. You're weird to say it like that. These are just random words I go for. Money's come up with quite a few. Yeah, let's have a look at this one. I don't know why these ones always attract me. Police station. Yeah. When I was young, we ran away on my birthday. Bob Dylan was playing in London and we thought we could break into his tour bus and have him take us with him. The taxi driver we paid to drop us off. I mean, we'd saved money. Pinched a bit here and there to pay for the fare. He was suspicious because we were so young, so he told the police. So they came and picked us up and took me back to Portsmouth. My mum picked me up from the station. But All right. I blamed everything on my friend Dean. My parents let me off. Okay. Eve? I don't reckon Eve's going to come up with anything. Oh, apparently it is. Okay, it was probably the same story, if I'm honest. It's probably just a continuation. Yes. We'd fight. We fought on the beach once and I held Eve's head underwater. You're crazy. You're crazy, you're gonna kill I peeps. Around. We got to far under the beach and I held her head under and I kept it out. She's mad. She's and bloody mental. I just wanted to kill her. And watch her drown. What? You're crazy. But that was it. It was just a moment. Oh yeah, that was it. Yeah, it's fine. We made up afterwards. It was a love hate relationship. Yeah, so something I really say to the police. Oh yeah, I did. I did actually want to kill my friend once. Yeah, I. Uh, I actually held her head under the water until she nearly drowned, and I wanted her to drown. I'm not crazy. I didn't do it. Well. Fucking hell. My friend. I mean, she was a friend from when I was a kid. She was always more popular with the girls. I used to hate her for it. Mm. Really hate her sometimes. Yeah, so you tried to fucking murder her, you mad bitch. I don't feel like I'm getting anywhere, that's the problem. My dad never had any reason to notice. They were always busy. If Hannah was eating a lot, they didn't mind. Hannah? She put on any weight. But a girl has a healthy appetite. Um, if they heard. Us talking in the attic, they just thought it was Hannah playing one of her games, and that Eve was our imaginary friend. <laughs> Once, she was already up and dressed and ready to go to school, and I snuck down for a piss. A piss? She saw me in my underwear, she went mad. Get dressed this instant! So I ducked into our bedroom, <laughs> and seconds later, out came Hannah, dressed and ready. My mum was amazed. Yeah, that was weird. So, yeah, I remember this. She was doing a lie detector test and she was like, oh no. And she kind of forgets what her name yes. is. My name is Hannah Smith. Oh, shit. Sorry. See, now to me that seems like she's lying. Like, her name isn't Hannah, so she's already, like, fucked up. But I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know where I'm going anywhere. Oh, what? 
Well, I'm going to end that there. I don't think I'm going to play anymore, if I'm honest. I am lost. I don't know what I'm doing. If you could help me leave it in the comments, I might do some more. But really, I am just lost as fuck. And uh, I honestly don't know whether you'll even see this episode because I don't think I've achieved anything and I don't think it was very good. But if I do put it out, thank you for watching it. Uh, please leave a like, leave a comment and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Okay, I have done a little bit of digging online to find out about what the ending to the game is or what kind of... Yeah, because I kind of expected some sort of like cutscene or something, or finally like, I don't know, you played it for like two hours and it's like, oh, here's, yeah, you found it. But basically, it's kind of all open to interpretation, I think. And I think I'm pretty much there. I'm on a site that's sort of doing a review, kind of explanation of the game, and it says, it's mainly focused on the fact that there's two people, that you find out that she's a twin. I found that out ages ago. And then... Uh, blah, blah, blah. The hair that we found out this episode is apparently from a wig, Eve's wig, pretending to be each other, which I already figured out they were pretending to be each other. And then a video that we saw this episode that says, my sister is gone and she's never coming back, shows that she murdered him, which I kind of figured anyway. I, I said that, I swear I said that in another episode. So I think, honestly, we kind of finished it. That's, I'm kind of... I mean, I don't know, I'm kind of pleased. I kind of figured it out a bit ago that it was one of those two and that they were a twin and all that stuff. And it's just these final little pieces like the hair and stuff that I didn't know before, but I found out this episode kind of put it all together. So that's kind of the end, I suppose. And I think we're done there. Uh, that's how I figured. I figured that, that it was, you know, one of the sisters, they're working together kind of thing. And it was... It was the sister that got pregnant but her but they pretend to be each other so i don't know uh that's just what i think and i think i have nothing more to gain from that game there's nothing more i can find really so uh that is honestly the end of the game i'm happy i please i'm happy i'm pleased i'm happy and pleased that i managed to sort of finish it and get to a point where i'm, I'm happy with what i found out but i wouldn't have known that if i didn't check it so that's kind of stupid anyway that there's no, like, ending to it. I don't like that. I prefer an ending. Otherwise, I could play that for, like, forever and never be 100% sure. Just search random terms and never get anything. But thank you guys for watching. Like I said, bye! Oh, my God! I just watched him die in front of me. That was horrible. You're dead. What the fuck is this piece of shit?